Okay, um, I'm back after a, a brief hiatus of a couple of weeks. Um, you can probably tell with the makeup already what's going on with this tutorial. Um, if you live under a rock, uh, you wouldn't be aware of this, but everybody else is. The Suicide Squad movie dropped on Friday. I saw it yesterday. It was incredible. Um, all the, the critics and everything who, who downed it and such... Don't listen to them. If you're a fan, go see it. Definitely go see it. Um, I myself have been a big Harley Quinn fan for years. Um, I do not idolize her and the Joker's relationship. Um, that's abuse. It's, it's, no. Her character was made to represent, uh, domestic violence. And I was into it back when the cartoon came out. So I had no idea what that was about. But, um, the character, uh, Margot Robbie... The, the actress, she did an amazing job uh, owning her own version of Harley. Um, Harley in the movie was over-sexualized, which kind of bothered me a little bit. There was a lot of, like, booty shots, and her outfit was pretty skimpy compared to oh, what the options could have been. But I didn't make it. Um, I did enjoy the movie. I plan on seeing it more than just the one time yesterday. So, um... I'm not really going to sit here and complain about the, the things that I didn't like about the movie. This is a makeup video. Um, I had already started a video um, for this um, with just my face prepped with um, Bosha uh, Subaki oil and um, Cover FX uh, mattifying acne treatment uh, primer. And, uh, for some reason my phone decided to stop recording. So my face was already prepped and I was showing you guys, I was applying, um, of course now I can't find the sample baggie. Uh, it is Kat Von D Locket Foundation and I think it is, oh, here it is. Uh, the color is L42. So, um, I wiped my face down, you know, perfect acid bath, bleach job, white, uh, with just one layer of that. Um, and of course, you know, I, I did the little heart there. Um, now I'm going to move on to the eyeshadow. Um, you can't really tell that it's glittery in this package, but this is Wet n Wild's uh, Stay Wild Bust a Wrap uh, Trio, I guess you would call it. Uh, it's color icon, and then I'm also going to use this, and it is also wet and wild color icon, and it's glitter, and it's called Groupie. Um, well, I had it on pause. I also did my eyebrows with the unique medium brow kit. Sorry, ladies and gents, I'm not blonde. I, I can't pull off the, the Margot look, but I'm at least going to do the makeup. Um, and I did my lashes with, uh, Dior Show Curl, I mean, uh, Dior Show Over Curl, Iconic Over Curl, yeah, that stuff, that new mascara I'm swearing by. Okay, um, I'm gonna pause, put a couple dabs of glitter glue on my lids to make sure that the eyeshadow sticks well and doesn't have a ton of fallout. Um, and then I'll show you guys how that looks, or I'll show you guys me applying the, the pink and the blue. Hope you guys enjoy. I am back, my pretties, and, uh, I've got the Too Faced, can't really see it, but it feels tacky, uh, glitter glue on both eyeshadows. I'm applying the pink first. Now, this is my first time really using the glitter glue. I mean, I do know how good of a product it is and such, but I've never used it myself. So I'm not quite familiar with how long play time from application of glue to application of glitter that we really have. Um, it's still tacky. Um, the glitter's still sticking. But this is the first eye, too. Okay, let me get this looking good, and then I will show you the blue. Uh, okay, this is the pink. You can notice over here is it what looks like a little bit of fallout, but I did that intentional. It's just a little dab, dab, dab type of deal. Um, because if you look in the movie, her eyeshadow is not perfect, and it... 
it um uh I wouldn't call it runny, but it definitely has like some streaky aspects to it. Let me pause and get this right. It looks like a hot mess right now. Okay, so uh, the glittery blue was kind of a fail, and um, I'm a bit, di bit disappointed. Um, I should have known. Uh, I brought out some NYX Face and Body Glitter in violet. I mean, that looks freaking black, doesn't it, guys? I mean, really. And that was a deep midnight blue with sparkles. And it came out looking this horrific black. Um, like, kind of messed up the glitter glue. Like, no. Not cool. So, let me put a little bit more on so you can still see this. Uh, anybody check out the, the Anastasia Moonchild, uh, highlighter kit? Oh my god, that is gorgeous. My best friend showed me that, and I am freaking in love. I think that's gonna be my next purchase. I also looked at the, uh, Milk, uh, holographic, uh, highlighter stick that's like a lavender. And that's like $28, and to me... To pay $8 more, to have um, five more colors and color combinations, yeah, i definitely going to go with the Anastasia, but um, as bad as the left eye come out, uh, this was supposed to be uh, an interpretation of Harley's makeup, but, oh yeah, now you can see the blue. <laughs> But uh, that side was supposed to be like a dark navy blue and um, or midnight blue. And I mean, look. Look at that. That's not blue. That came out black. Black. No. Okay. So, I mean, with what I have to work with, I'm not a fan of blue eyeshadow. The only reason I had that was because it was in a trio. Um, this is the uh, the pigment, the glitter, I mean, that I used over the, the wet and wild blue. When I bought the pink, um, I bought a silver uh, shadow, too, and I was looking for a blue glitter one. Um, I was hoping the one that I had in the trio would work out. I'm a little, I'm more than a little, I'm really bummed out that I didn't, because this is supposed to be a really fun, easy breezy tutorial, but it's done, um, the makeup didn't quite match up, because she's wearing more of a brighter blue, um, I didn't think it would be as deeply pigmented either as it is, but I did my best. At least I got the cute little heart. Oh, the lipstick. Duh. Hang on. Um, I was panicking when I was getting ready to do this because I don't do red lips. I do not have any red in my arsenal. But then I remembered I had the Vice, uh, Urban Decay Vice 24-pack um, sampler. So this is color 714. It is a red. I am going to apply that with a, a e.l.f lip brush and we will be done with this tutorial in the ugly left eye all right uh there it is um it's kind of a red orange um in true color but uh there is my harley quinn look if i could do the voice i would totally come out with hey pudding at you but i can't i'm sorry and I'm sorry that the left eye is so, so badly effed up. I am so sorry. That was not supposed to happen. Wrong product. My bad. Um, I purposely didn't do my lips perfectly because um, if you watch the movie later on to it, like, her makeup gets, like, all messy, you know, underneath. And 
her lipstick is like off to the side and such so this is it go see the movie tell me how much you love it happy faces everybody